Okay, what I'd like to do is show you how to um, solve this um, equation where we have 5 divided by x plus 5 minus 3 divided by x minus 5 equals 6 divided by x squared minus 25. So the first thing we want to remember when doing this type of problem is whenever you're co trying to combine fractions, you know, adding or subtracting them, you have to make sure that their denominators are the same. So here what I notice is these denominators are not the same, so I have to get them to be the same denominator. And let's go back to an elementary example. If I did x one third minus one over four, I remember you had to get these to be the same denominator, which which you usually you want to pick your least common multiple, and which was twelve. So what I would have to do is multiply by four over four on this side, and three over three on this side, and then what I got was four twelfths minus three twelfths. Then from there I could solve my problem, right? Well, here it's the exact same thing. What we're going to do is we're going to have to multiply by our least common multiple. So our least common multiple for these problems are going to be um, is going to be x x plus five x minus five. So I'm going to multiply this by x minus five on the top and the bottom. Here I'm going to multiply this by x plus five on the top and the bottom. So then what I'll have now is I have 5 times x minus 5 all over. Now there, I can notice, is a difference of two squares. So what I can do is I can square this minus 25 equals, I'm sorry, minus 3 times x plus 5 all over. Again, this is going to be the same denominator, x squared minus 25 equals 6 over x squared minus 25. So now, since these all have the same denominator, I can multiply them by that common denominator. Same thing like it was like this. You know, 1 fourth minus 1 third equals, uh, or, you know, what are, I'm sorry, 1 fourth minus, or let's do 2 fourths minus 1 fourth equals, uh, you know, 1 fourth. You can just cancel all the fourths out. 2 minus 1 equals 1, right? So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to multiply everything by my uh, denominator. And what you'll notice is these will all cancel out. So therefore I'm left with 5x minus 5 minus 3x plus 5 equals 6. Now what I can do is use distributive property to give me a 5x minus 25 minus 3x minus 15 equals 6. I combine my like terms, so I get 2x uh, minus 40, 30, 40 equals 6. I add 40 to both sides, and what I obtain is 2x equals 46, divide by 2, x equals 23. And there you go. That's how you solve um, that problem given rational expressions.